Oh, Robert. Hello, Robert. Zomina. Um, yes, it's outside. Go get him. We have to pack and leave this place at once. Go, go, Zomina! Obina! Obina, please, hurry. Come, come, come. Come inside. Obina! She's inside. Damn it, Robert. All the time. Hey! Dilika! What are you still doing? Take him to the car! Look him. Oh. No. The incident took place early hours of today. Our correspondent. Now, tell me what is that? Are you still in the house? Now, talk to me. What is going on? You understand? Damn it. 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 Damn we're currently at the crime scene where police are still carrying out their investigations oh, while we are made the name to conclude on this report. Yeah. Poor Naomi. Now we better be good this time around, Robert. Investigative journalist Team Masage and his wife, who were driving home that evening, were ambushed by unknown gunmen. They were shot to the chest and to the head twice. Excuse me, ma'am. What would you say about the current investigation from the Nemi team? Well, Aunt! 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 Mom! Dad! Who is on TV? Do you make it? We must leave now. No, I want to so Mom, listen. tell me. I will explain. Just put it on. Put it on! What happened to Put mom? it on! Let's go, let's go. No! No! <laughs> Go inside, what are you waiting for?
Ibrahim. <laughs> Hello. Good evening, Robert. Thanks for coming. Mm. Ah. Sit, please. Thank you. Thank you. Secrets hidden beneath, hidden beneath. Evil displayed as the smile on your face. You tend to forget that karma exists. <laughs> Oh, my daddy. How are you? I'm fine. Oh. I've missed you so much. I've missed you so much. Look at you. What have you been eating? Bugger. You've been big. Look at your son. Dad. Son. Have a good day. You're welcome back home. Oh, thank you, Dad. I'm proud of you. Thank you. <laughs> we'll see you dinner. Ah, Mr. Ibrahim. Thank you, thank you very much. Let me. Thank you, Robert. You're welcome. Ibrahim. Oh, Fatima, are you okay? You're suddenly very pale. Robert, I'm fine. Are you it's, sure? I'm sure. Fatima, here. Yeah. 
It's all right. Aren't you all right, sweetheart? I'm all right. Now I'm good. So as you can see, she's fine. Enjoy your meal, Robert. Ooh. Mm. Ooh. A beautiful evening by all ramifications. Mm. What's wrong? Dinner. How could you, Robert? In front of everyone. In front of your son. In front of your friend. How could you? Does that mean you have no shame left in your eyes? What are you talking about? You're flirting with Fatima. That's what I'm talking about. How could you? Come on. Does it mean you cannot get your eyes off anything that looks like a woman? Well, but she's a woman. Oh, you should be ashamed of yourself. Look, it was it was just dinner. Don't don't beat yourself about it. Otherwise, you're going to get more wrinkles. Oh really? Mm. Just dinner, you say? Mm -hmm. You call it just dinner? She is your friend's wife. I'm asking you, Robert. Mm. Damn it! What is all this? All right. All right. All right. Ugh. Can you imagine him? Ugh, just like that. You son of... Damn it. And hey, I do not have wrinkles, you pathetic old man. Raincoat, you are just an idiot. What are you going to stop? What are you talking about? You and Robert. There's nothing going on between Robert and me. Well, don't you dare give me that act. I saw the way he was looking at you. You are having an affair with him. No. We're not doing anything wrong. Are you going to deny it? Ibrahim, you have to trust me. You, you, you want me to trust you? Are you, are you serious? You want me to trust you? Did you tell him that I hit you too? Is that why he kept talking about your makeup? I'm talking to you! I don't know. Why did they keep asking me about Jamaica? Why? I'm crying. Huh? I don't know. I didn't tell him anything. Did he promised one lie. Did you tell him, tell him anything? Well, he knows. I didn't tell him anything. He knows. Oh, he knows. I don't know why. You know, he knows. Me you don't know how he knows. Uh, huh? Uh, Ibrahim, please. You know Robert. He's a smart man. He's, he's very intelligent. Please. Please, please. You know, Robert, he's a smart man. Maybe. Maybe what? Maybe. Maybe. Maybe what? Maybe what? Talk to me. Maybe what? Huh? Maybe what?
Hello? Um, I'll be there first thing tomorrow morning. That was your boyfriend. That was your freaking boyfriend! As if he knew you were in trouble. Clean that mess. Mom. Where is that? At the usual spot. Oh. Are you right? Mom, what happened? Mom. What happened? Nothing. Don't tell me it's nothing and you're looking this way. What happened? It's that, right? So he hasn't changed. We all saw what he did at the dining with that lady. It's all right, sweetheart. It's not to believe me. I don't... Look, I'm not a child. Okay, so stop. I can see what's going on. So there's no point trying to cover things up. Don't cover for him. Sweetheart, listen. I'm not covering anything. He's really not um, as terrible as he makes himself look. Oh, he's not as terrible as he makes himself look. Well, who makes himself look terrible that isn't terrible? For years I've watched you. Try to hold this family together, mom. And you've tried. Okay, yes. I, I cut my cap for you. You're a superwoman. You're strong. But please, it's time to let go. Oh, come on. Don't talk like that, sweetheart. Listen, I cannot watch everything we've labored for, all that we've worked for, tear apart just like that. For what? Is it for me? Because... I'm good, okay? I'm good. I just want you to get out of this hellhole you call a marriage, okay? No. Oh, no, mom. No, sweetheart. No, mom. This has been going on for, for what? Years now, right? I remember as a kid, I watched that put you through so much. See, your father and I. Oh, mom, stop. Please, we all know the kind of man that is. So there's no point trying to cover up for you. Listen, sweetheart. Oh, mom, no, look, mom. Can you hear me? Now? It's okay. Look, mom. You've done enough. You've tried. Okay, keeping up with that, you've tried. Okay, it's okay to divorce. You can. I would rather have both my parents separated and live without you. To have you dead, mom. This man is going to drag you. He's going to sink you. Please. It's okay. I can't stand you crying. Please. Hello. I want... Results, first thing tomorrow morning, unfailingly. I make myself clear? Great.
You have it? Yes, sir. So, is something wrong? I'm sorry. What? Oh! Sit. Thank you. Is everything okay? Personal matters. Right. All right. As we proposed, exactly. In this file, you'll get everything you need to know about. Uh, that land. Please do what you have to do. I want all of them evacuated from that land. Um, Robert, I I stand to believe that the state government has issued a mandate concerning this land. Ibrahim. Hey, This is being handled by your ministry. And I want to believe that you'll do what you have to do. Hmm? Of course. Good. Good. Well, that's settled. How is uh, Fatima ah uh, she she she's fine great great Oh, sorry. Oh, I'm so sorry. I wasn't looking. I'm, I'm really sorry. What? You look very familiar. Me? Yeah. Um, Hilton Housing Estate. Naomi? Wait a minute. Obina! Oh, my God! Oh, my God! It's so good to see you! It's so good to see you! Whoa! How have you been? I mean, I'm good. <laughs> wow. It's been 15 years since you guys left the estate. Oh, well, yeah. You know, I heard what happened to your parents. Oh, we're so little. By the time I, we, my family got back, uh, we were told your aunt had taken you away. Oh, yeah. I had to stay with her at that time, you know. Wow. Uh, you know, we should sit and talk. Yeah. Uh, a lot of catching up to do. Right. Yeah. So, um, are you married? No, I'm not. Oh, beautiful. What? Oh, I meant um, we should talk more, like we have a lot of talking right. to do. <laughs> yeah, sure. so um, can I have your number? Of course, why not? Okay. Wow. Okay. Uh, okay, there we go. Yeah. Okay. Um, <laughs> I will call you, huh? Yeah, sure. Good to uh, see you, really. Yeah, you too. By the way, you look beautiful. Oh, thank you. <laughs> All right. Thank you. Bye. Wow. <laughs> yeah.
He knows. Robert. You have nothing to worry about. Ibrahim is my boy. I will take care of him. What will you do? Will you hurt him? The way he's been hurting you? Look, you can hide the, the scars under your makeup. Or you can never hide the pain in your eyes. I can make him stop hurting. No. I don't want trouble. I don't want a problem. Ibrahim is my husband. Yes, but I care for you. I care about you much more than I care for, for any other person. Robert, I know. What you and I share is, is different. It's special. Allow me. I can make him pay for it. No. He, he, I am wrong. Ibrahim, is, 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 he hasn't done anything wrong. I should not be having an affair. He has a right to beat me. I deserve it. Fatima, my dear, you have been so used you've gotten so used to being abused please allow me to take care of ibrahim he, he needs to have a taste of his own medicine please this has to stop robert hmm? yes that's it I agree with you, my dear. It has to stop. Hmm? No, please. Let's go and stop. No, it. Robert. Please. Robert, please, no. Stop. Please, Robert, please, please, hmm. please, Robert, please, no. Hmm. Red gates, we don't reach. You know the difference. Uh, okay, I beg money no day. This one said I manage this. Thank you. Yeah, uh, hi, Obina. Hi, Naomi. I told you I was going to call. How are you doing? Um, 
I'm fine. Thanks. Okay. So, um, I was wondering, can I invite you over for dinner? I'm sure my mom will be excited to see you. Um, Please don't say no, no. You know, we're once neighbors. And we have a lot of catching up to do. Okay. Okay. So, I will text you the address. Are you free this evening? Yes, I am. Okay, good. That means I'll see you later tonight then, this evening. Okay, that's fine. Okay. Thanks, bye. Joy, yes, why is it taking so much time? Sorry, Ooh. sorry, mom. Sorry, it smells nice. <sighs> hey, mom. How you Hello, doing, Mr. Martin? <laughs> what is this? Has it been long you came back? Ah, uh, yeah, I I've been up for a while now. I was in my room. I see. Yes. So, um, what's for dinner? Well, uh, fried rice and chicken. Okay. I know you'll like it. Yeah, I will, of course. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, uh... <clears throat> what? What is it? Guess who I bumped into today? And who that be like? Naomi from our old neighborhood. Naomi? From our old neighborhood? Oh, come on, Mom. Think! She lost her parents when we were kind of young. <gasps> Uh-huh. Tim's daughter. Yeah. Uncle Tim's daughter. Where did you meet Naomi? Uh, we kind of bumped into each other at the mall. Yeah, and um, I kind of invited her for dinner. I beg your pardon. Oh, come on, Mom. It's just nothing like... Come on! You should have asked first. Mom, look, we are family. We kind of go way back. But even at that. Mom, don't be too serious, please. I beg you. Hey, young man. Now you listen to me. I'm not sure your father would like that idea. Uh, you know what? I'm sure you'll be as excited as I am when you meet her, right? You know, I, um, I used to wonder what became of her since she left. But no. It's good to know she's quite good and very beautiful too. <laughs> oh, mom, come on, live it up now. Don't be too serious. You know, I'm going to go up to my room, eh? You guys make this food really sweet. I love you. I trust you guys, though. Joy, what is this? The cutler is a deity. You know, we're expecting a guest. Please, please, please. Pick up that one, be fast. Sorry, we won't be fast about it. Now, Obina, this is past eight. I'm not sure she'll be coming again. So, sit, sit and have your dinner. Oh, I don't know, Mom. I'm just worried about her. Why is she not taking her calls? 
Well, I wouldn't know. Just sit. Sit and eat. Say it. Just... Just worried. No, relax. I'm sure she's fine. They're the one that is supposed to, you know, serve the mom. So please, mom, just please help me out here. <laughs> Why are you? La ila. La ila. Where are you coming from? Ibrahim, I... I went for a tea party. Aisha organized a tea party. I hope I he hope doesn't, doesn't search my bag. bag. What, what if, if he sees the envelope? I ask again. Where are you coming from? I'm telling you the truth. You want to see Robert, right? No. Why are you lying when you know I hate lies? No, I lie to lie. Oh. What are you doing? Give me a good reason why I shouldn't kill you right now. Please. Please. What do you want? I gave you everything. You have a nice house, a nice car. I gave you love and respect. Then why, Robert? Why? I'm sorry. I'm you know, Robert sorry. has done a lot for me. He's the reason I am the man I am today. Then why would you let him do this to me? Answer me! Please, please, I'm sorry. Do you want me to go after him? Is that what you want? You want me to go after him when you know I can't? You don't know that man. That man is vile and evil. Don't touch me. Do not touch me. He belongs to the underworld. That man can make you and I disappear in just a minute. Don't touch me. Don't, don't, don't freaking touch my hands. Don't touch me. What do you want? What does he do for you? What is it that he does for you that I can't do for you? What? He loves me. I love you! You don't love me! What kind of man claims to love his wife and yet he won't take one on her head? You're making me do this. It's your fault. It's not my fault. Just send me home. Divorce me. Send me back to my parents. 
Ibrahim, this is not love. This is just a, a show of power. Shut up. <laughs> you just want to throw me away. I you said shut up. Your fancy part. Shut up! Shut your mouth. If you were a faithful wife, I would not be pointing a gun at your head. Sorry, sorry, please. please just Why did you marry me if you did not love me? Don't touch me! Why? I will tell you just remove. Answer my damn question! Why did you marry me? I love you. But you were never around you. Always going out and you never cared for my emotional needs. Robert showed me love while you were away. So, you agreeing that you and Robert are having an affair? Because that is what you just said. That is what I heard you say right now. Don't give me that, Grammy! <laughs> What's wrong with you? Please. You can't talk anymore? I beg you, witness. Oh, God, please. 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 He loves me. <laughs> Robert loves me! He loves please take care of my needs and please, please. Well, I might as well get away with my life. I'm sorry, something came up. Well, you could have told me or at least pick up my call. I'm sorry. So, um, are you all right? Hello, are you there? Uh, uh, yeah, yeah. Um, uh, fine, yeah. Um, can we see tomorrow? Um, I can come to your place. Uh, uh, uh no. I'll find you. You will find me how? I will come around. Oh, okay. So, um, do I come pick you up? No, it, it's fine. I mean, I have the address you sent me. I'll see you tomorrow. Um, okay. Um, now, now... What's wrong with this girl? Well, at least, um, I'm happy nothing's wrong with her. She's fine. Mom was right. I was just worried for nothing. Dirty secrets hidden beneath. Evil display. The smile on your face You tend to forget That karma exists She'll get you on In a matter of time She'll find her Look Fatima, I just want to make sure you're okay Can you hear me? What's going on in there? Are, are, you, are you in there? Are you okay? Oh Fatima, please op open this door. Please.
<laughs> it better be good. Mm -hmm. What did you do? All right, break the door and take her to the hospital. You just hang in there and don't do anything stupid. <coughs> hey, I'm stepping out. What do you mean you're stepping out? Who was that on call? Was the person that called you? Just go back to sleep. I'll be back. Robert, I I don't understand. Hmm. Robert. Can you imagine? If she is dead, you need some good and capable hands to dispose of her. She's a side. I am so sorry for calling you out this late. We are the only one. Keep can... your apologies, Olivia. She's she's in there. Good. Fatima. Fatima, dear, it's it's Robert. Fatima. She's fine. She's fine. Come with me. Come. Robert, once again, I, I am so sorry. <laughs> What was that for? For doing silly things like this. What were you thinking of? If you're tired of her, then you get rid of her. But domestic violence? I have lived with a woman as difficult as Clara for over 30 years. As I have never lifted up my hand against her. You know why? These creatures are very dangerous and they are the easiest way to ruin a man. 
Ibrahim, you and I have come a long way. And it's going to be so, so shameful to see you go down this way. She's having an affair. She's cheating on me. Well, then grow some balls and confront the man who's invading your territory. Look, when we have a bad harvest, we cut the weeds and uh, disinfect the farm. We don't go burning the whole farm down. What if the man is very powerful? One more powerful than I am. Grow some more, my friend. Boys, let's go. Fatima? Fabina? Yes, sir? Mother says you ran into an old friend. Oh, yeah, uh, Naomi. Mr. Tim's daughter. Naomi? Yeah, uh... We bumped into each other the other day and I thought to invite her. I see. Is everything okay, Dad? Mm. Yes. Uh, everything is okay. I'll do it. I'm sure. I'm sure. it. Fatima, I am, I am sorry. Can you forgive me? Baby. You know, I didn't mean to hurt you. I don't know what came over me. I just lost control. Please forgive me. Fatima, I said I am sorry. You need to forgive me. Mm. 
Dirty secrets hidden beneath. Hidden beneath. Evil displayed as the smile on your face. You tend to forget that karma exists. She'll get you one day. In a matter of time, she'll find her way. Dirty secrets hidden beneath. What were you thinking? your mind. Are you crazy, Clara? I'm not crazy, Robert. Obina was the one that invited her. I didn't do anything. Yes, but you did not stop it. You, did it. you allowed her? How could you have allowed that girl into this house? Calm down, Robert. Just calm down. Calm down? Are you listening to yourself? I supposed to do what am I supposed to tell Obina that she is forbidden from stepping her foot in this compound is that what I'm supposed to do why what will be my reason what am I supposed to tell them that the reason is well that was your responsibility to tackle years ago oh. you were supposed to have tackled that years ago I see I was beginning to think you were not going to show up. <laughs> well, I don't always disappoint. Uh, <laughs> okay, yeah, please um, sit. I would um, let mom and dad know you're here. Okay. All right. Thank you. <sighs> Good day, sir. And who are you? Dad! Ah, oh, she's my guest. Good day, man. Hi. Now. Good to see you again. Good to see you too, man. Mm -hmm. Like this finger. <laughs> so it's God has done a lot See in how tall you are now. Excuse me, why not? Why not? <laughs> I'm impressed, honestly. I know, I'm also impressed. So, what are we here now? Thank you very much, my friend. Ah, my rat hole. Just a small place, I live alone. <laughs> Thank you, ma. Oh, I thought you were living with your auntie. You remember this? Oh my god. When you were kids. You always liked my people. I do. <laughs> oh my god. Thank you, ma. You're welcome. Oh yeah, I was living with my auntie, but then she traveled uh, to the state with her husband a couple of years ago. Oh. Oh, so yeah. why didn't you follow them? I was still schooling them. Oh. Yeah. I see. Mm. This is really nice. Brings back memories. Mm, I love it. Karma, karma, 
in time, in time. Don't you forget that karma exists. She'll get you one day. So are you sure you don't want me to drive you home? Oh no, it's fine. I'll just take a cab. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Abbott, please, I hope you come back. Of course. Now that I've visited, I'll come more often. <laughs> Bye, sir. Don't worry, it's always like that. My boy's going to come around. Please. It's been years. He probably doesn't remember me. Yeah. I'm sure he does. This guy. Anyways, yeah. I'll get going. Um, thanks for having me. Sure. Take care of yourself. Yeah. You're good. You too. Bye. Oh, okay. Karma, karma, in time, in time. Karma, karma, in time, in time. Oh. Mom? What's wrong? I don't think you should continue seeing Naomi. Why? That's because I think she's not good enough for you. What are you saying, Mom? I just met Naomi and uh, we are friends. Besides, you were excited to see her. Yeah, she was our guest, so I treated her like one. But believe me when I tell you this, I don't really like her. You don't like her? Oh, there's something you're not saying. All right, your father doesn't want her to keep coming to this place. That's because she brings back some awful memories. Her late father and your father were friends. So as you can see, everything about her is filled with bad memories. I should have known it was all about father. I mean, it's always all about father. Well, um, I think it's good for everyone. It's good for you and him. Because as for me, I'm good with her coming to visit me here. Like if you guys don't want her to come here, good. I'm going to go visit her because I intend to still be her friend. And please, mom, Naomi's not responsible for how that feels. If dad wants to be gloomy, good. It's his business. He has his nerves. This is his own cup of tea. He can. Don't blame that poor girl for it. Beg you. Keep quiet, Abina. Look, mom, just go get some rest, okay? Go rest and stop carrying the weight of the world on your shoulder. Please. Are you asking me to leave your room? Yeah, please just... just I dressed your bed for you. And now you're asking me to leave. No, please. Just, just. I should have allowed your bed no. to... Mom, that's Betty. Get out. Very bad. Tim was a very good man and very courageous as well. I found out he was working on a case. It was something he kept to himself. I picked up some of these files from his desk. And I think there may be more information in this computer. 
He was investigating a very dangerous cartel. Ms. Vera, I shouldn't be telling you this, but as it stands now, with the way the police are handling this investigation, I doubt if the culprit will be punished. Please. I want justice for my brother and his wife. Please. Do what you can. Please. It's time. As it stands now, with the way the police are handling this investigation, I doubt if the culprit will be punished. Please. I want justice for my brother and his wife. Please. Do what you can. Take a look at this, Robert. It's all over social media. What's that? Look. And she claims he pointed a gun at her. And not just once. And that she has videos. More videos to that dad. I never knew Ibrahim to be this despicable. Dad. Robert. Do you know anything about this? Robert. I'm asking you, Robert. Now, Robert, tell me you know nothing about Fatima's interview. Even the devil will be amazed the way you accuse me of every evil that runs the land. I know about it. I know that both of you have seen each other 
I have seen the way you are flattened with her. All right. And because of that, I will put her up to this. Oh, please! I stand to gain. Answer my questions! Stop. Enough! And by the way, have you resolved the Naomi issue with Obina? She will never let me live in peace. If you're here to see Fatima, she's already gone. I have come to see you. How are you? She has ruined my life. I feel so embarrassed and frustrated. I can't show my face anywhere. The media, everyone is after me. She has finally succeeded in destroying my entire life. You should be ashamed of yourself. First, for hitting her. And second? You know about it all this while, don't you? About what? The affair. Right under our noses, those two. You know about it. So I suggest you leave my house. Ibrahim, why don't you be a man for once? I mean, walk up to him and tell him to stay away from your wife. And sure, your marriage got this bad because you discovered the truth about both of them. Yet, you couldn't do anything about it. Hmm? And poor Fatima had to suffer for it all alone, whereas... She's not the only culprit here. Fatima and I are separated at the moment. And you think Robert is not behind it? Oh, come on, open your eyes, man. He is behind it. He has been looking for a way to push you away and to have your wife all by himself. Oh, that's it. You need to stop it. You need to walk up to him and tell him to stay the hell away from your wife. That's what you should do. Fine. I'll leave. <laughs> she is your fourth. After all, you are going to marry the fifth one. The sixth, seventh, eight, nine, ten, till you become like the King Solomon of the old. And I promise you, he will keep taking all of them away from you, leaving you alone on earth to be miserable. That's what you want. Maybe you're the one that needs courage. When you stop covering up for his sins and making excuses for him, only then will Robert learn to set boundaries. Whatever he is today, it's because of you. You feed his ego and nurture the monster. We all had to suffer for it. It's all on you, Clara. It's all on you. May 16th, 2007. You're responsible for whatever Fatima is going through. You are responsible for all the numerous deaths. George. George? He killed him. What? Yes. He has never stopped since that day. That was the first time he tasted blood. You helped him wipe his mother. Now he's a vampire. He can only survive by blood. Robert will not stop killing the people that loves him. And oh, I hear your son is now hanging out with his daughter. Tim's daughter. Clara. Can't you see that karma is right outside your door, knocking and it's only a matter of time before it strikes? She was just a child. 
And hoping the meeting that was just a coincidence. Robert would have told you in our line of work, there is no such thing as coincidence. Good night. Robert, thank God you are here. I'm so happy to see you. I didn't know where else to go. Ibrahim, he's, he's after my life. He wants to destroy me. He will do anything to kill me. Why did you do it? I promised to help you. Why go that far? I had to do it. Ibrahim was out for blood. Who helped you? You're not the type to pull that type of stunt. Fatima? Robert, I can't say anything for now. I can't tell you anything. Fatima? Who helped you? Robert! What's in me? And I'll do much more than that if you don't tell me what I want to hear. You know. I don't have to go into details tell you how ruthless I can be. Daddy, you know, one lady, she, she knew so much about us. She threatened to expose us for what we're doing. So, so I had who? to... What else does she know? I don't know, but she helped me get rid of Ibrahim. Why? Maybe she wanted uh, revenge. Ibrahim could have hurt her in the past. So maybe she wanted uh, evidence to destroy him. She said something about evidence. What evidence? Robert, I don't know. I said what evidence? Something about um, May 2007. Was it? She didn't tell me her name. I don't know her name, but who is Naomi? Naomi. What else does she know? I don't know what else she knows. All these questions you are asking me. Did you give her the evidence? No, I didn't give her any evidence, but I did some research. I got curious and... And I discovered there was some assassination on that date. I think you will have to go and stay at the guest house. Oh no, I'm I'll so afraid. They will make arrangements for you to leave the court. Hmm? You go, go. Bobby will be there to hand the keys over to you. Hmm? Robert, I'm, I'm, I'm scared. You will be fine. You will be fine. You go. Go. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes, my... I'll see you. I'll be seeing you. Mm -hmm. Hey, Robert. Hello. Uh, 
Hello? What? Did you get in? Through the door, of course. I don't climb walls. I'm not Spider-Man. All right, all right. Don't stress your little brain. Bobby here is a professional lock picker. What, what do you want? I have seen you getting very comfortable around my son. What is the catch? Obina and I are friends. You know we've been good friends since childhood. No. I, I can't remember. Mr. Carlo. Excuse me. What do you mean by Good friend. Hmm? Go on, go on, go on. I'm not interested in dating your son, if that's what you're worried about. Hallelujah. At least we have uh, established that fact. Mr. Carl. Uh... See, you have a very simple life here. I don't think you want it disrupted, uh, do you? I thought as much. So let me make this point very clear. I don't like it when people poke me. What are you saying? In simple terms, I don't like you. And I don't like you anywhere around my son and my family. Why? Do you really want to know? Mm -mm. Fifteen years ago, you took me to a dark place and forced me to sell my soul to the devil. 
and I did. On that very day, Robert, I lost every morality in me for the sake of love for family. I was made to compromise my peace of mind for your sake. You asked me to lie to our child and to the entire society, and I did. I did all this for you. I lied. I have carried the burden of that awful day in my heart for the past 15 good years. And my heart is very weak now. I did all this for your sake and for the sake of this family. Hmm. My dear. Kanika. Yeah. Find something for him to eat. Our neighbor, did you know they are short? I'm talking about Naomi, poor Naomi's parents. Those young couple, who could have shot them just like that? What did they do? Because as far as I'm concerned, those people are quiet, calm people. And look at me, a mother. I couldn't even stay to console that little girl, Naomi. Now talk to me, Robert. What? What's all this? I did it. You did what? It wasn't supposed to end like this. I, I did what I had to do for our family. Which is? What, Robert? Listen. Uh, Ibrahim and I. Ah! Ibrahim and I got into a business with some people, and and they told us it, it was legal, so we invested heavily, not knowing they had lied to us. They were into smuggling and um, illegitimate business. Well, before you could know it, we had sunk in so much money, and then. One thing led to another and things got out of hand and, and some people were hurt. Uh, Tim, Tim, Tim was one of those, he was the investigative journalist who got onto us. And, uh, I, I begged Tim, I asked him, I said, let this go. I mean, just this once, Tim wouldn't, wouldn't accept. Tim was very stubborn about it. And, and then, and then, the cartel, strong, powerful men. I, I turned to them. I told them about the situation and they said, take care of him. And, and, and I had to take care of him. And you have to kill him. Hold on, I, hold on, hold on. You killed him. You killed him. I, I, and his wife. What did she do? I, I didn't want to go to jail and leave you. I mean, 
had to do what I had to do for our family. Please, my friends have asked me to stay under, to lie low and make sure I don't do anything suspicious. Suspicious? So, so that... Suspicious? And we ran. We left our house to this place. And you think it's not suspicious enough? Mm. Who thought that? Come on, man, think. I mean, who runs away from their house when their neighbor has just been assassinated? Come on. I panicked. I, I, I thought the police, that they were already on their way to the house. I'm sorry. And not the police. I thought they were on to me. I'm sorry, but I, I, I need to know that you. Enough. I love you. I love you, Clan. I feel so vulnerable. Please, I, I, I need you as my backup. I love you. Please. I'm, I'm so sorry. I just had to do it. Please. You've said enough. Gosh. <sighs> Robert. Yeah. What can I do? I mean, what am I going to say now? You're my husband. Must you mess up? Listen, we will return to the house this evening. The house? That's the right thing to do. Robert, I need you to listen to me. You've made yet another mistake. Why? You keep making mistakes. I keep cleaning up for you. Now allow me to handle this. Since you want me to be with you, do I have any other choice? You're my husband. We will return this evening. We will go to our neighbors and act like nothing happened. And that's it. We will have to go sympathize with them. I think. That's the right thing to do. That's it. That's the right thing to do. Thank you. I'm so grateful. Please, Robert, please. I bore this burden in my heart. For the past 15 good years, knowing fully well that you killed someone, I lied. I lied to the whole world wearing a fake smile. And each time I faced the media, I shared crocodile tears telling them how sorry I was for our neighbor's death praying and hoping that someday that the criminals involved will be captured one day and will be dealt with severely hmm I did that much for you, Robert. And what did I get in return? You made mockery of my love. Fatima too. Oh yes, she was my friend. Her husband, Ibrahim, your own friend. Our friends, they are. 
How could you? How could you? Where is your conscience? Robert, where is your heart? You are indeed the devil's incarnate. A despicable man you are. And believe me, when I tell you this this day, standing face to face with you, I hate you. The girl was too much. What girl? Robert! You dare not. She's like a loose canal. It's just a matter of time. She's just a little girl. She doesn't know a thing. Yeah. Why? Haven't you heard the word? Coincidence before. It's nothing like coins. Now you listen to me. I am going to tell you this. Enough. I know you. Everything in and out. And I challenge you to stay. I tell you to your face. I will never allow you. Hand that girl. I, 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 I don't really want to harm her, but she must get out of this town. I don't want her anywhere near us. Do you understand? Whoa. Mm. I will match you this time with everything in me. I will. Pretend to forget that karma exists. It's so strange that this is happening just weeks after her video of domestic violence was leaked all over social media. Now, social media is buzzing, saying that this was no accident, but a well thought out murder. Well, the current economy of Nigeria is messed up. We are having a downsize to everything. Prices are going up, fuel scarcity is everywhere. I knew you were going to do something as silly as this. So, what are you trying to do? Run away? Of course. Mm. You know what the media is saying about me? To everyone out there, I am the prime suspect. In no time, the police will find a way to pay my wife's death to me. People will think I killed my wife because she came out to reveal to the public about her domestic violence. And when you run away now, what happens? You're no longer a prime suspect? I just lost my wife, Robert. Your wife has been talking to someone. Wait. You saw my wife before she died? I am sure. You knew that your wife and I were having an affair. Oh, come on, my friend. Your, your anger is of no use to you now. You know I can take you away like a puff of smoke if I wanted to. I hope you don't forget that I'm calling the shots here. You are a monster. I won't deny your accusations, but for now, you have to lie low. 
I don't know. One more thing. All right. I am going to make this Fatima affair go away for good. Don't worry about the social media. That will boss for a week or two. And then we'll move on to something next. I'm going to make it look like it never happened. But it happened. I have lost everything. Hmm. Robert. Did you kill her? I don't know. Well, I remember I made a call, some few calls that day. Shit. You killed her? Hey, don't play smart with me, Brian. Why? Because if you do, you wouldn't even be alive to stand trial at your wife's murder. Could make it look like suicide. Huh? Huh? Look, I don't want to go into details to let you know how far I can go to remove any potential threat I see on my way. Robert, you and I know who she's been talking with. You have been keeping tabs on her. You know where she lives, who she talks to. You know everything about her, but she's still out there. Fatima spoke to her once and she got killed. But why is she still out there? What are you scared of, Robert? Why are you holding back? You and I know she's a loose thread. She knows too much. She's out there to destroy you, yet she's still alive. Why? Why haven't you killed her? Because she's my daughter. <laughs> Naomi is my daughter. I've always known that a long time ago. I, I, I know where she lives. I had men follow her. I even had a DNA test done on her. Naomi is my daughter. You? Yes, I'm a, I'm a vain man. I've made some mistakes. I had an affair with uh, Tim's wife. And at their deaths, I... I had this nagging feeling. Um, Naomi was my daughter. But you know? I used to have these arguments with her in those years. And she kept insisting that she was Tim's daughter. But, you know, when I see my blood, I always know. So, I had men follow her. Somewhere along the line, they got me some document, something for the DNA test. What are you? A monster. Yes. What have you not done, Robert? I am sure the devil himself will be marveled. Well, what Helen and I shared was special. I mean, I loved her. We had a strong connection. She was your neighbor's wife. Just like what you and Fatima shared was special. She told me that herself. Yet, you killed them both. There's no more redemption for you, Robert. I will be the one to take care of Naomi. No one should get involved. No. Your son likes her, and he will go for her. How do you intend to stop him? Ibrahim, I would advise that you face your own problems. You have enough on your plate already.
Don't you forget that karma exists. I'm sorry. It wasn't supposed to end like this. Thank you for your courage. You think that the world revolves around your rules. Don't you have a conscience? Can't you see? It blew up in your face. She's around and she's found a way. In time, in time, karma, karma, in time, in time. Don't you forget that karma exists. Robert, not this night, Clara. Go to bed. Karma, 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 in time. Don't you forget that karma exists. Don't you forget She'll get you one day. In a matter of time, she'll find her way. Oh. Dad. Yeah, you did that. Um, Good day, sir. Naomi, you, you met her before. Sorry about that, okay? Can you just please sit? I'll be right back, okay? Okay, sure. All right. Dad, what's wrong? So, all I'm asking is that you stay away from that girl. Why? Dad, I love her. Okay, I've loved her ever since we were kids. Why are you trying to stop this? Because she shares the same blood with her sister. There's even a DNA report to the effect in my jaw. That how could you? Wait. You and Mrs. Helen. So I have made some mistakes. Some I am proud of. Some. I really don't give a damn about. As for this, so you'll be fine. You'll be fine.
You're a very stubborn girl, aren't you? Well, I took after my father. Indeed. Hello. Meet me in the minister's office. Yes. Or right. I'll see you around, young lady. By the way, your father must be very proud of you. He was a good man. He made some mistakes. But then, who is free of sin? I, I pray that someday, You will find it in your heart to forgive your father. Hello? Hello. What's the update? <sighs> Naomi, we are trailing him now. This is our chance. A man identified to be a popular investigative journalist, Tim Osage, and his wife, Maria Osage, have been killed in the early hours of this morning by some unknown gunmen. We're currently at the crime scene where police are still carrying out their investigations while we are made the neighbor to conclude on these reports. Yes. Yes, proceed. What? Are you alright? Um, um, yes, um... I'm, I'm waiting for Obino. He went upstairs. Um, Ma, please, can I use the restroom? Oh, sure. Why not? It was not there. The top door. Okay. Are you left? Thank you, Ma. Me. What 
what's wrong? What, what, what are you doing here? Just, just can't. joke, right? You both murdered my parents! You all are responsible! And this... lies. Now we wait. Now we stop, please. He's responsible. He murdered my parents. They are all responsible. You need to stop them. They're going to kill him. You need to stop them. No. Shit. What is going on? Who? You need to call your dad. Some people are after him and they're going to kill him. You need to call him right now. Call your dad! Call your dad! Just call him. Oh, God! 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 Oh,
Come here. Obina said you wanted to see me. Sit. How were you able to know that my husband was going to be assassinated on that day? <clears throat> I'm sorry I couldn't save him. I tried. I know. I know you were behind his assassination. Oh, please. Don't act all surprised. I know the reason you assassinated him. May 16, 2007. Of course. Robert killed your parents. That I know. And I did the worst by helping him to clear it up. I wasn't supposed to do that. Believe me when I tell you this. Robert reaped what he sold. The only sad thing here is that you've got blood on your tiny hands now. Revenge is not the best option. That's what camera is for. Hey, it's all right. Mm -mm. You have shed a tears enough. Don't be too hard on yourself. I promise you, no one will know about this. Obina will not know. The secret of a strong woman is buried in her belly. He will only know about the DNA report and that's it. I shouldn't have. I'm sorry. It's okay. I have forgiven you long time ago. I just want you to forgive me. That's all. Please. Come here. Come, my child. Sorry. It's okay. It's all right. It's all right. Dirty secrets hidden beneath hidden beneath Evil displayed as the smile on your face You tend to forget that karma exists She'll get you on in a matter of By the way. Your father must be very proud of you. He was a good man. He made some mistakes. But then, who is free of sin? Bye, Dad. 
Don't worry, it's always like that. Believe me when I tell you this. Robert reaps what he sold. The only sad thing here is that you've got blood on your tiny hands. All these years, I believe that was despicable. But you, Mom. Robina, please. Oh. You indulged him. You encouraged him. You are to blame, too. I know. I made a very big mistake. Ah, mistake. For 15 good years. That was not a mistake. It became a lifestyle for both of you. You. Were you really going to live without me? How did you find me? Well, it seems my dad has been keeping tabs on you. I thought we were a family. Okay. I need you to come home with me. Can't. Why not? That foundation was built on my parents' blood. I can't live there. 
Look, I'm sorry. I'm sorry too. It's not your fault. Okay. I mean, I, I didn't have any right to take your father away from you. It's our father. Okay. Our father. I mean, it's, it's true what they say. Do not waste time on revenge. Karma would eventually catch up with those that hurt us. Taking revenge was a, was a terrible decision. I mean, so many lives lo lost and I still feel so miserable hey, hey, and hey, lonely. Hey, 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 come here. It's okay, okay. It's okay. Like you've got me, okay? You've got me. And you've got my mom. We are a family, right? Believe me, I have always wanted a sister. A baby sister. I love you. I love you too. Evil display, that's the smile on your face. Okay. You tend to forget that karma exists. She'll get you one day, in a matter of time, she'll find her way. Dirty secrets hidden beneath. Displayed as the smile on your face. Tend to forget that karma exists. Oh, she'll get you one day. In a matter of time, she'll find her way.